Are your feet cold from walking on the hardwood floors? Do you always feel the need to wear socks or slippers? I know this sends cold shivers throughout your body. It does me just thinking about it. What if I told you spray foam insulation was a better insulator than the traditional fiberglass batting insulation? Stay tuned to find out if spray foam is the best option to insulate your crawl space. Hi, I'm Nolan Beery, and I'm the Director of Sales at AccuLevel. I've been around the foundation business since my family started AccuLevel in 1996. I began working full-time at AccuLevel in 2013. For years, homes have been built using fiberglass insulation. This type of insulation may not be the most efficient type of insulation to use in your crawl space. In this video, I will tell you how spray foam and fiberglass batting work. Finally, I will compare spray foam and fiberglass batting insulation. Spray foam begins as two liquids. When mixed together, they become a wet foam. The foam expands, then dries to cover the space between floor joists, along band boards, and even along walls if you are planning to finish your basement. This includes all cracks, holes, and crevices. When spray foam is applied to a clean or dry surface, it creates a barrier. This barrier is a great form of insulation. The spray foam we use at AccuLevel has an R value of 6.7. It can also protect your subfloor from moisture and mold. Spray foam also deters insects and larger pests. Once spray foam insulation is applied, it has to be scraped off if you're wanting to remove it, so it's there to stay. Fiberglass batting insulation is fiberglass attached to a paper backing. Fiberglass batting has to be installed by tacking the insulation up with staples. Fiberglass insulation has an R value up to 4.3. Fiberglass batting is able to come loose and fall. This creates an opportunity for cold air and moisture to infiltrate your subfloor. Fiberglass batting also holds moisture which can also turn into mold. At AccuLevel, we use spray foam to insulate crawl spaces. One of the biggest reasons we use spray foam is because the R value of spray foam is so much greater than the R value of fiberglass batting. Also, spray foam is easier to apply and immediately sticks. If you have more questions about crawl space insulation, give us a call to schedule an appointment with one of our project advisors. You can also go to our homepage, AccuLevel.com and click the book a consultation button at the top right corner. Fill out the form and we will contact you within the next business day. Do you have more questions about the crawl space installation process? If so, please leave them in the comments below and we will be happy to answer those questions for you. Check out the description for more videos and blog articles on crawl space and foundation repair. We noticed that about 99% of the people who watch our videos are not subscribed. So if you could take a second to like and subscribe, we would greatly appreciate it. Thank you so much for watching.